Am I on? Mm-hmm. All right, cool. Uh, so, anyway, so I'm Lou. This is Louie's Boozies. Um, this is episode five. We're doing um, Monsters in Quarantine edition. So I started just messing around with a bunch of stuff, and I, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure it's probably going to be horrible. But it's worth a shot. It's normally what I always do. Like, I just mess up a bunch of things, and sometimes I get lucky, sometimes I don't get lucky. Hi, Lena's mom. Um, so, basically, uh, I was actually working with some jelly beans. Because, um, again, what I like to do, so as I've said before, is I work with what I have around the house. I had some jelly beans, and I was like, I was pulling off all, like, the outer casing of the jelly beans. Like, a little bit of green, a little bit of purple, a little bit of blue. And it was perfect. I had it ready. And then I brought it over into the kitchen, and it knocked all out of my hands on the floor. This was like... I don't know, like 20 minutes worth of work at least. So I dropped to my knees and I was like really upset. So uh, Dorothy, my wife, she ended up helping me uh, with um, some sprinkles and stuff. So the color isn't exactly what I, you know, what I wanted to originally, but but it'll work, hopefully. Again, if, they, if I pull this off, it's going to look pretty cool. Hey, what's up, Brittany? How are you doing? So anyway, so again, Monsters, Inc. For me, you know, there's, there's always the thought of what's better, Monsters, Inc. or Monsters University. I love Monsters University. That's my favorite Pixar movie. I think it's great, and um, it's hard for me to choose between Soli and Wasowski. But um, um, you know, a lot of people, uh, a lot of people have different favorites as well. Some people like Randall. Some people like you know Boo. We have Boo over here and whatnot. And the Uzma Kappa hat from Monsters University. So anyway, let's get cracking on this. All right, enough. Um, so let's start mixing, shall we? All right, so basically, I'm only working with two. Um, I'm working with two uh, alcohol uh, spirits uh, right now because usually, I mean, you could either go with vodka or you could go with rum. Um, but I figure the more alcohol, the better, so the drunker you get. So anyway, so we're just gonna work with a bunch of alcohol. So first, we're gonna do two ounces of uh, rum. Rum for my Boricuas out there, like Brittany. Two ounces. Boom. Done. That's it. Set. All right, and then we're going to be going with, uh, again, um, I could have went with the Belvedere that I have. Um, been all hoity-toity, or I could go with, what is this again? I always forget the name. Zubrufka. Zubrufka, and that's the bison grass. It's got the blade in there. I like it again because it's got a really, really nice taste to it. Now, with this one, we're not going to go as heavy on it. We're going to go one and a half ounces. Um... Again, this is just to have alcohol. So, so we have that. Now we're gonna start getting a little bit interesting and I'm really, really hoping I pull this off. I'm not sure if I'm going to. Um, so, now what I already did was I already went ahead and right here is about two ounces. I went and I did some creamer and I did half simple syrup. This is gonna be a sweet drink by the way. So now we got that in there. All right. Then I have some almond milk here. Figure with the almond milk. You want to go ahead and you want to do probably, you know, let's go ahead and let's do an ounce and a half of that bad boy. Nice and milky, you know. And, you know, go two ounces. Feel a little bit better about that. All right. Now what I did was I went ahead and I took these Jet Puff Frozen frozen two um, marshmallows and I melted them down. Um, and I don't know how this is going to work. I don't know if it's going to look good. I don't know. Uh, I, I will see. So all I can say is we'll see. It's probably going to be very interesting. Let's just put it that way. All right. So put that mixture in there. All right. And now just a little bit of ice because obviously this is really really high right now so there we go and again like I always say I wish I had my tools from work but I don't so I use this I mean I do like it just because you know it's got the skulls on it and then you just gonna shake it up. <laughs> this thing is terrible looks like it has a crack in the top too <laughs> that's great all right here we go you want to get a good shake on it obviously this is in a great shape, but trust me, I'm actually just keeping the stuff in here because it wants to come out. 
All right. Now, with that being shaken, now here comes the fun part that I don't know if it's going to work or not. Now, what I decided to do with this is I decided to grab a raspberry, and I'm going to use this raspberry to hopefully do what I need it to do. So you cut the raspberry, and then what I'm going to do is I actually want to get some of this stuff around the edge mostly. A lot of times you want to rim it. You want to get a good rim on the top. Um, but I want to get a lot of it on the side because I actually want to get some... I want to get some look to it. What's up, Erica? I miss you, Erica. All right, so now here's the little weird thing that was made. I don't know, again, I'm trying. I'm hoping it works, we're gonna see. It's working a little bit. Actually, it's not too bad. Again, this is just sugar with sprinkles. That's all it really is, just to give it a little bit of a look. I mean, it's not going to be as impressive as if, you know, somebody that knew what they were doing did it, but it's all right. You know, it's not too bad. Okay. So now I'm going to put the ice in here. I might end up needing some more ice. But here we go. See how this comes. ice in here. If you'll give me one moment, please. So yeah, so I'm wearing a shirt right now, and uh, the shirt says Louis Boozies on it. It's, um, sorry. it was actually made by uh, Crafts by Gab. She made it for me. Um, right now, if you wanted one at all, you could have one for $15, or they, she does do baseball tees for $17. That's the cost. Um, that's just so I can get my name on you. You know what I mean? I'm not gonna charge you more uh, at all. I'm not looking to make any money off of it. I'm looking just to put my name on people, because that's how I am. All right, so I'm gonna put a little more of this bad boy in here just to top us off. All right, and now, almost done. I want to get a little bit of this in here, just so I can put my eyeballs. A weird look to it. And I have some of these eyeballs, little eyeballs right here. Let's see if that will stay. Again, I'm really praying this comes out good. I'm really praying it tastes good. I don't know if it's going to. What's up, Megan? How are you? Um, but just remember one thing. I tried. All right? Okay, so we're almost there. Um, two more things, and then it'll be really, really, uh, hopefully, pretty tasty. So this is a, this is a chocolate-covered pretzel. It's got a, almost like the Cosmic Brownies. You eat the Cosmic first. Um, that's a joke that my friend uh, James Rustwick um, from The Big Fuss, a great band by the way, um, used to say when we were younger in a band together. But anyway, so I'm going to put this bad boy in here. All right. Yeah. And then last but not least, I'm going back to my Frozen 2 marshmallows. And again, I don't have my tools, so I have to use a, have to use a straw, okay? Don't judge. Or judge, do whatever you want, obviously. All right. One more, we're going through. And this. is the Monsters Inc. drink. Um, I hope you guys, you know, uh, I don't know if you would even think about trying that, uh, to make that. I don't even know if it's any good. I hope it's good. Um, I'm gonna make my wife try it. Um, again, if you want a shirt, just DM me. I can get you one, obviously. Um, and, uh, let me know what's your favorite uh, Monsters, Inc., if it's Monsters, Inc., or if it's Monsters University, mine is Monsters University. Um, I'll catch you guys next week with something hopefully uh, just as fun. Bye.